Well, hello, good people. Today, I wanted to answer a very common question I got regarding focus. And Abdul here asked it a few days ago. How do you point to an existing model folder, something like automatic 1111, comfy UI? I'm going to show you how to do that today. It's super, super easy. So the first thing we need to do is go into the main focus folder. Now I use the Pinocchio installer. So my path is a bit longer than some of you that might have installed it uh, manually. But in my case, it's on my C drive users under my name. Pinocchio. So if you're a Pinocchio user, your structure will look similar to mine under API focus original. I created an extra folder for my own personal reasons, I tend to put other files in there. And then within the main focus folder, you see here there's a models folder. This is the native models folder. So typically by default, this is where you would install your models. If we scroll down just a tad and look for this file called config.txt, let's double click on that and open it up. And then you're going to see some various paths here where certain files are located. For example, checkpoints, otherwise known as your models folder. These are where your LORAs will be, embeddings, so on and so forth. So all you have to simply do is find where your other model folder is and type in the URL address just like this, keeping the structure in this format. So if we look at my path from this point on, you'll see that I have all my models pointing to my automatic 1111 models folder. And what's very important is that you, number one, use these backslashes, and then you got to make sure you copy the name of the folder exactly how it is. Like for example, see here under users, it's a capital U. Initially I had it as a lowercase and it wasn't working. So upper and lowercase matters here. So at this point, if you are, let's say an automatic 1111 user, you're going to do the same thing. Find your main automatic 1111 folder. In my case, it's located here. So you'll see my folder structure up here at the top and within automatic 1111, we'll go under the models folder and stable diffusion. Now at this point, what you could do is just right click copy address as text. And then you could paste it into the proper area here. So I'd paste it in between these quotes here and then just add an extra backslash in between to your folder address here and so on and so forth. Now I'm not going to do that since I've done it and make sure you close with quotes and that there's a comma at the end of it. And then there's this closing curly bracket. Then just go ahead, click file, save. Okay. Now, obviously you want to check to make sure that it worked. Once you start up focus, go into your models folder and just double check and make sure all your models have been loaded. In my case, it looks good. So it's a pretty simple process. I explained this to Abdul by text and he responded a day ago saying it worked. Thank you very much. You're very welcome, Abdul. Great question. I'm sure other people will find some use out of it. And in case you're new to Focus and you've just installed it already, make sure to check out any one of these videos on in painting or face swapping. Until the next video, my friends, I'll see you when I see you.